All right, guys, Jeremy LaFrance with Backstage Entertainment, sitting here with Joseph and Will of Cartel. Guys, what's going on? Hanging out. Yeah. Hanging out. We're hanging out in the lounge area, as you can see here, too. I'll tell you, I mean, Cartel, you guys are actually the band I've heard of on this tour. I mean, looking, researching everything, and because of your guys' song, honestly, that's one of my favorites, actually. But I guess when you guys are on this tour, and any tour, I'm sure, do you get quite a few fans to sing along with that song? Oh, with Honestly? Yeah. Oh, yeah, every night. Kids usually they jump around and sing the words to that one, yeah. Yep. But what's really cool about this tour also is um, we just came out with an EP, and it's only got five songs on it, and I didn't know how many people were going to know the words by this right. tour, but um, a lot of people are singing along to those, too, so that's okay. surprising. It's nice. Well, that's good. So you guys have developed quite a bit of fan base there. I mean, uh, talking about that EP called In Stereo, mm -hmm. and then you guys had that out. What's really kind of coming up as far as album-wise even after that? Uh, I guess I guess the plan is to do a full length. You yeah, know, like full length. We've got a bunch of. We always have songs that are just always floating around. You know, right. and I think we're the kind of band that um, we don't allow that to. They, we don't allow them to float around for too long. We got to yeah. make up a song eventually. You know, so yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, we'll probably be doing that. And then I want to do some covers. Maybe record some covers. We'll okay. see. Yeah. Okay. So pretty much be a summer, just recording yeah. a whole bunch of different stuff, and then yeah. come back and tour in the fall. Okay. So do that hard work in the summer and then exactly you know, tour let the again. heat pass over before yeah. we uh, uh, yeah. us old men get back in and <laughs> get burn out. Do you have a preference Literally. of touring versus recording? I mean, I know with touring you get to see the fans and everything, but recording you get to make your own music and get some fresh stuff out there. What's your guys' preference? I like the studio better just because uh, it's like like you said the creative front. Yep. And it's kind of where you get to nerd out a little bit and you know yeah. twist some knobs and you kind of get it, it's just a different. It's the one thing you don't do that often, being in a band. Right. You know, you tour, play shows a whole lot, but like being in a studio, it's just, it, it's such a uh, engaging experience that mm -hmm. it makes it uh, a lot of fun. Okay, well good. good. Versus yeah. going on tour and sounding like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone gets sick, yeah, right. everyone goes out, it's just... Yeah, it's Are you a little sick tonight, Will? Oh yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah, it goes around. It's that type of season. You know, I'm on antibiotics, so you're cool. Okay, yeah, no, you're I just got over it, so I think I'm all right, too. Yeah, last week was just hell for me, so <laughs> you know how it goes. Oh, yeah. Um, but for the other fans out there, too, that are maybe just hearing about Cartel for the first time, let them know maybe their top two or three songs. I mean, besides, honestly, I, in my opinion, that's what the first one they should go listen to. Sure. But other than that, uh, for them to get the Cartel vibe going, what do you guys want them to listen to? Ooh. Hard one, huh? Uh... Deep All South, yeah. Deep South off okay. our uh, third record cycles. That's a that's a good jam. Okay. What else? I mean, just tell them listen to all of them, right? Well, yeah, listen to all of them. <laughs> go buy all the albums. Yeah. Just listen to all the songs. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we start. have such a diverse array of songs. It's almost yeah. like. I don't know. Yeah, it's cause like, you can go and listen to one song, and that might sound like a few others. But we try not to make every song sound. Yeah. I mean, you know. Uh, some people might disagree with that, but I, we, we try to not make them sound the same, you know? <laughs> especially on the second record. We had a lot of songs that went in uh, a lot of different directions. Yeah. And uh, even with Cycles, we had like the hard, the hard songs, kind of faster punk songs, really slow ballads. You know, we try to make it a very interesting record. So, okay. so as far as like picking a, like a couple songs, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's hard to do. Uh, yeah, it's really hard to do. But right. Deep South, I say, would be one and maybe like... Burn the city gets kind of crazy towards the end, so yeah, I guess that those, cool. that's all very indicative. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, personal question. I mean, I was revisiting your guys' video for honestly, and kind of has a, a kind of a unique story to it. But can you guys give the fans kind of an in-depth thing about the music video too, honestly? Because you guys have two people at a computer, or they're trying to you know oh, right. meet and stuff like that. What's really the how did that idea come up, and what's the meaning behind that? Even. For me, I'm kind of curious. <laughs> I mean, at the time, it was just, um, that was kind of like right when MySpace was probably at its peak. Right. Um, you know, everybody was, it's when the MySpace photo started, you know, yeah. doing all that stuff. So exactly. Right when that happened was right when the video was getting made. And uh, the guys who made the video had this idea, like, you know, kind of, because we're not actors. You know, it's like, we, we're just going to stand Not yet. There. We're not, not actors yet. yet. Yeah. Not yet. This is your Hollywood debut coming yeah. up. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, uh, you know, that was our first video, so it was like, all right, we're just going to play, and you're going to okay. film us playing a bunch, and that's going to be what we do. And then, um, so they, I obviously had to have a story go along with it. Right. So, um, is that actually a group of friends that we grew up with uh, that lived in New York, had this whole concept, okay. um, and did video production, so. Yep. Um, came up with it, and uh, that's pretty much it. It's a MySpace tri uh, tryst. Yeah. 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 So throughout the video, they're, they, like, even meet 
or something yeah. like the one or couple like, passes the street yeah. and everything. And or it's like that thing. I mean, we all have friends on our whatever social network that we know only through that site, pretty much. Right. You know, like maybe you've met them once out at a bar, and then they add you on Facebook, and then that's it. Your whole relationship is just a picture on a screen, and kind of that video shows like people who only have that kind of interaction and then seeing each other in the real world it's yeah. like oh you know should i say hello or whatever right, right. just walk by yeah and not say anything we might have an outtake here we have somebody trying to get in here oh, oh, oh well, we're, we're cutting i don't know Take. well if the ladies don't mind back there we're, we'll keep going with okay, the interview yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah i don't know a lot too. all right we have people trying to get in or whatever but we're going to keep going this is backstage entertainment we're showing backstage yeah, stuff. that's what happened exactly but hey this leads to our next part in the interview like i mentioned to you guys we have the bsc box fans have found us on facebook like backstage entertainment actually submitted questions for guys uh like you guys and you know the bands we interview so we'll do a couple here and you guys have an answer for each other's questions you can or just answer your own it's up to you let's see let's see Where's the craziest place you signed your autograph? On a baby's head. Ah. Or, or, or was it the rumpus? The rumpus. <laughs> baby's head was kind of weird. We did, yeah. we, I did sign a baby's head, that's for sure. I've never signed a baby's head, or did I sign that same baby's head? I thought maybe the mom dropped the diaper for a sec just to sign the butt. Uh, I thought. I don't remember that. Could be dead wrong. But yes, a baby's head. A baby head. in general a, is even pretty crazy. It's true. So. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> put a permanent marker on my child, yes. please. Yes, then we're going to go get it tattooed. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Kid grows All up right. with a... I don't yeah. even know who this band is. Yeah. It's not cool. <laughs> All right. But uh, let's, we'll keep going here. All right. Joseph, let's Okay, my turn. Let's pick this out. It's like a fortune cookie. Yep, it is. Oh, oh well, we grabbed four for well, fortune cookies. Grab four, they count as one. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, we're good. Yep. Okay. Once again, we're backstage. Okay. <laughs> what superpower do you want, and what would be the first thing you'd do with it? Oh, you, you have an answer? No. Uh, <laughs> tell us again the question. Yeah. Well, my, it, my first pick, it used to be flying. And then I realized I'm terrified of heights. So like, oh. why would I want to fly right. anywhere? You know what I mean? Just right. in case it gave out. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but my other superpower would be uh, just to get places really fast. Because I'm very impatient. Oh. So like, tele oh. if I could okay. teleport, go. that's what I would do. That would be cool. Because I mean, you could, being invisible, you're, I mean, you're still in the same spot. Yep. No one could see you. But if you just don't want to be there anymore, you could teleport and go somewhere else. Okay. Right, let me Psychokinesis. Try. That's yeah. what I want. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna draw. My mind. <laughs> I'm gonna draw one for you guys. I'm gonna see if I can answer the quickest. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. All right, ready? Ooh, craziest fan story. Wow. Like a, a girl's just like jumped all over you or something, or just bugged the hell out of you. Hmm. I don't know. We're kind of on the keep it real front, so yep. like, yeah. there's not a whole lot of like this built up even amongst like super fans, there's not like this celebrity sort of thing. So we don't really have that. It's not the all time low effect, you know, where those guys, yeah. those girls are nuts after right. their shows. <laughs> yeah, no. I was just like, hey, what's up? I'm like, hey, hey you want me to sign that shirt? Okay. All you right. know, it's like, no big deal there. <laughs> I can't think of a crazy, uh, it's not anything crazy that happened. Yeah. We get this question a lot, actually. Like, craziest yeah. thing a fan's ever done, and we're always like trying to remember anything that happened. I don't remember. Yeah. Uh, well, maybe I tonight, mean, tonight's tonight, tonight tattooed? Maybe. Some guy said, hey, have sex with my girlfriend. That's Remember, true. he was like, Will, have sex with my girlfriend. He's, She's like, yeah. He was serious about it. He too. was dead serious about he it. Serious. So that's kind of crazy. I mean, who does that? Punch him in the face. <laughs> I, don't I don't know. I mean, that's a... We'll just say he's no longer with us. <laughs> exactly. All right. Well, guys, just for the fans out there, again, let them know where they can go to find Cartel for more information. Uh, our website is cartelrocks.com. It actually has a new, new face, like, uh, since about... Two weeks ago. Yeah, oh. brand new site. Brand new site. Awesome. Um, Twitter is at Cartel. Okay. And uh, Facebook slash Cartel. Slash Cartel, yeah. <laughs> Pretty simple, but if you go to the website, it'll, it'll link you to all the other yeah. things you need it to do. It has our, uh, our online store for merch and CDs and links to iTunes and all that stuff. What happens if people Google Cartel? <laughs> you might not get you right. No, it comes up. Actually, it? Cartel is the first right Our biggest nice. person. Yeah, number one nice. search. All right. All right, so Google Cartel and just pay attention to number one. <laughs> not the drug cartel. We're not from Mexico. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's cool. Especially if you're a cop. Yeah. That's right. That's right. <laughs> All right. Well, guys, once again, Backstage Entertainment here with Joseph and Will Cartel. Definitely go check them out. And, guys, any last words for the fans? Stay in school. That's right. <laughs> Stay in school, guys. Thanks, guys. That's good. Yeah. Hey, everyone. Make sure to like Backstage Entertainment on Facebook to see our photos, to enter yourself into contests for autographed prizes, and other news. Also, make sure to click the subscribe button on YouTube to check out the rest of our videos. 
And you can find us on Twitter to get updates about what we're doing. For Backstage Entertainment, this is Jeremy LaFrance.